Well this week at the wagon shop here on Main Street in Joliet, I'm going to finally finish up the trimming on these seats and do the diamond pattern on the seat backs. Now a lot of seats were sewn in diamonds back in the carriage day, although there were some that were tufted and folded. Well this is the old original seat back that came off of this buggy that I demonstrated in an earlier video. You can see there were seven diamonds that they were stitched in and not folded. Now you can find a number of videos out there that show you how to do the folded or pleated style diamond. But most of the time these videos are focusing on household furniture. Well the, the base used in furniture is foam, but foam is not correct or traditional to buggies. So I'm going to do it in the old traditional style and use this wood fiber called Excelsior and put it back to this old style that was on this buggy. So this is the project for this week, is to do the seat backs on this buggy. Now there are a number of ways that these seat backs can be assembled when you have a spring base. Like I say, we're not going to use foam. I'm going to use a backer board, or oftentimes what's called a panel board, to tuft these diamonds into. This can also be done to a piece of burlap if it is stretched over a frame and held tight and do all the tufting to that. You'll see them both ways, but I'm going to do it on a paddle board on this seat.
Now this style of stuffing that I'm going to do on this seat back is not a traditional style that you will find in home upholstery furniture. This is a carriage style. It's an old traditional style and it's a very firm base for the seat back and the cushion both. But you want this. The buggy seat is not made really for cushion and comfort. It's made for stability and durability while it's being driven.
Well this is the last step of the restoration of this two seat buggy. The final process is to assemble all the parts and do all the touch up. Then we're going to send this rascal home. Anyway this is the whole process that covers a lot of different aspects of the carriage trade. Appreciate your interest and your following along and as always thanks for watching. <laughs>